In the heart of South America lies an ecological magnificence and biodiversity that stands as a testament to the awe-inspiring power of nature. The Amazon rainforest is harboring 20 shocking discoveries that shocked the world. Keep on watching if you dare to learn these secrets. Number 20. Most Powerful Eel In the Amazon, they discovered a supercharged electric eel capable of delivering a record-breaking 860-volt jolt. This discovery brings the commonly held belief that the greater Amazonia region was home to only one species of electric eel into doubt. Following extensive research and DNA analysis, scientists identified three distinct species. Each species likes its own habitat, and Electrophorus voltae, the newly discovered species, is most likely an adaptation to highland waters. This discovery sheds light on the Amazon rainforest's enormous diversity of life and emphasizes the need to defend it from threats such as deforestation and wildfires. Not to mention, it means that there could be tons of undiscovered species in the Amazon that could aid in medical and scientific progress. But wait, there are more mysteries that puzzle us. Number 19. Boiling River The Chenet Timpishka, also known as La Bamba, is a 6.4 km long tributary of Peru's Amazon River that is described as the only boiling river in the world. Its unusually high water temperatures range from 45 degrees Celsius to nearly 100 degrees Celsius. Despite the name, which indicates solar heating, the heat source is geothermal. It can be found in the Mayan Tuyaku Sanctuary, which is home to an Ashaninka people, and is believed to have been created by a giant snake spirit known as Mother of the Waters. Andres Ruzo, a geothermal researcher, investigated its origins and determined that it can maintain high temperatures while being far from active volcanoes or geothermal vents. According to popular belief, this is due to the Earth's geothermal gradient, in which rainfall penetrates the crust, heats up, and rises to the surface via fault-fed hot springs. The river is under threat from deforestation, which is primarily the result of local residents selling attractive trees and clearing burning the rest. Maple Energy, a local company, has taken measures to protect the neighboring jungle. But wait, this next mystery still leaves us in the dark. Number 18. Tribal People The Yanomami tribe, which lives in the deep Amazon rainforest, provides a unique glimpse into human microbial life that has been unaffected by modern civilization. When scientists first discovered a strange tree in their region in 1973, it ignited a mystery that lasted nearly 50 years. The tree's tiny, orange, lantern-shaped fruits baffled specialists, who couldn't place it in any recognized plant family. According to DNA analysis, it belongs to the Picromniakii family, demonstrating nature's ability to adapt and defy expectations. This revelation has far-reaching implications for the effectiveness of drugs. It implies that antibiotic-resistant genes may have existed prior to their use in medicine, raising concerns about the growing threat posed by drug-resistant bacteria. With antibiotics losing their effectiveness against infectious diseases, there is an urgent need for novel research in this area. While the Amazon's flora holds cryptic tales, its tribes carry even more startling traditions. Number 17. Shocking Ritual Deep in the state of Amazonas is a tribe known as the Satere Mao. This indigenous tribe has stood the test of time, and it might be thanks to their penchant for tolerating extreme pain. They have an estimated population of 13,350 people, and they all have made peace with their unsettling rituals. You see, they encourage the boys within their tribe to go through an initial ritual so disturbing that it would make one squirm in their seat. The ritual requires a boy to wear a glove that's been covered with sedated bullet ants. When the ants gain consciousness, they begin to sting the hands of the boy wearing them, but why do they endure such pain is the real question. Apparently, the tribe believes that in order for the young men to become warriors, they should be able to bear crippling pain. This ritual, you see, is a gateway into a tradition of power, tenacity, and unwavering courage for the Sater Mao. Only after going through such a life-altering experience will that boy truly transition from boyhood to manhood. It's an achievement worthy of awe, adoration, and maybe even envy. 
It just goes to show that the civilizations lurking in the shadows of the Amazon rainforest are a complete enigma to us. Except this isn't the only thing that has caught the attention of the world. Number 16. Creepy Silk Structures Have you heard about the silk henge structures? Well, scientists have been attempting to figure out what is making small silk structures stand out in Tambapata, Peru, for the past decade. Each features a ring of pillars connected by horizontal threads to form a fence with a cone in the center. After collecting and observing multiple specimens, researchers began to notice spiders hatching from the structure in the center. Although the fact that the builders are spiders is eye-opening, scientists are still unsure of what species they are because no evident adult owners of the Silkhenge buildings were discovered. No other spider has ever been documented laying only one egg in an egg sac. In fact, most spiders maintain a bundle of eggs on their webs to safeguard them until they hatch. It's puzzling to think that despite decades of photography and documentaries, there continues to be a creature we have no knowledge of. But there are some creatures that have been caught on camera. Number 15. Rare Dolphin Dolphins might be cute, but one specific species is on the brink of extinction. The Araguayan River Dolphin, once thought to be a distant memory in the annals of extinction, has resurfaced from the shadows. Yes, you read that correctly. It's not a phantom or a fiction of our mind. It's a living, breathing species in the heart of the awe-inspiring Amazon. Just when we thought it was gone, this river dolphin emerged, proclaiming, I'm not extinct, folks. I'm distinct. That is correct. Scientists, equipped with their keen eyes and awe, concluded that this magnificent creature was no ordinary river dolphin. No, sir. It is a distinct species that has carved its own path through the Amazon's aquatic wildlife. The Araguayan River Dolphin is swimming in all its glory, a testament to nature's ability to surprise. It's also a testament to life's ability to endure on Earth. It's a wake-up call, a reminder that nature still holds secrets beyond our wildest imaginations. This unexpected find rewrites the story of a species we thought we knew, changing our understanding of the Amazon's aquatic habitat. But wait, it's the only rare and unique discovery that has stunned all those who come across it. Number 14. Geoglyphs. Even the Amazon has secrets of a time long gone. According to new research, massive geometric earthworks discovered in the Amazon jungle were built after humans had already begun changing the forest ecology. Between the 1st and 15th centuries, these geoglyphs, which were trenches as broad as 36 feet and as deep as 13 feet, were built. The purpose of these enormous ditches, discovered in the 1990s due to deforestation for agriculture, remains unknown. According to the study, which was led by archaeologist Jenny Watling, humans have been modifying the Amazonian woods for nearly 4,000 years. Soil tests from two geoglyph sites in Brazil revealed indications of human-set fires and an increase in palm palms, implying that the landscape was intentionally manipulated for food and resources. Despite the presence of geoglyphs, there is no evidence of permanent settlement. Interestingly, there are indicators that rituals were performed there, according to Watling, such as crushed adorned pots discovered near the entrances to several geoglyphs. People may have visited the geoglyph sites on an irregular basis, probably during harvest seasons, to gather food from the prehistoric supermarket. The researchers discovered that the forest has been dominated by bamboo for at least 6,000 years, demonstrating a certain level of resistance to climatic change and human activities. Either way, the history of mankind continues to puzzle us, much like this next eerie creature. Number 13. Goliath Bird Eater the Goliath bird eater, scientifically known as Therophosa blondi, is the world's largest tarantula, weighing up to six ounces and stretching about a foot in length. Despite its name, it primarily feeds on insects but may prey on birds on occasion. It uses powerful teeth to inject neurotoxins into its prey, liquefying their insides before ingestion. These spiders have weak eyesight and rely on vibrations detected by sensitive leg hairs. When threatened, they emit urticating hairs with stinging barbs as a protection mechanism. These hairs are used by female goliaths to guard their egg sacs, which can contain 50 to 150 eggs. Hatchlings remain close to their mothers until they reach the age of two to three years. Goliaths employ their silk-spinning abilities to line their tunnels rather than building webs. 
Their venom, while dangerous to small species, is not lethal to humans, causing a sting comparable to that of a wasp. But guess what? Goliath bird eaters are considered a delicacy in some parts of South America, however, their hair must be removed before cooking. While that's an appetizer few would dare eat, it continues to inspire fear among those who aren't familiar with this beastly creature. Except, you don't need spider venom to cause immense pain. Number 12. Bullet Ant The bullet ant possesses one of the most painful stings among insects, attributed to its neurotoxic venom. The stinger is small, measuring 1 to 3 mm, but a single sting can cause intense and prolonged burning pain lasting up to 8 hours. The bullet ant's sting is famously excruciating, earning it the highest rank on Justin O. Schmidt's Sting Pain Index at 4+. Schmidt poetically described the pain as akin to walking over hot coals with a 3-inch nail in your heel. Some have even likened it to the sensation of being shot, which inspired its name. Victims report enduring relentless waves of burning and throbbing pain for up to a full day. Symptoms include swollen lymph nodes, edema, rapid heartbeat, and, in severe cases, painful poop. The venom contains ponerotoxin, a paralyzing neurotoxin that affects nerve channels, potentially holding promise for medical applications under investigation. Bullet ants are found in the rainforest ranging from Nicaragua to Paraguay. They nest in various locations, including trees, shrubs, and underground. They're even used for a disturbing ritual by a certain tribe, which we'll tell you about in a minute. Now wait till you hear about this next reptile. Number 11. Jesus Lizard The common basilisk lizard, also called the Jesus Christ Lizard, earned its nickname due to its remarkable ability to run on water. The species was identified and named by naturalists and taxonomists in the 18th century who found them primarily in Central American rainforests. These lizards sunbathe in trees to warm their cold blood, making them vulnerable to predators like birds. In moments of danger, the Jesus lizard will leap onto a stream or river, dashing across the water's surface to swiftly escape. Apart from their water-running abilities, they're even great climbers and runners. They can run up to a speed of 15 meters per hour, and they can hold their breath for a whopping 30 minutes underwater. These basilisk lizards have long toes with fringes of skin, which creates a larger surface area that helps them stay afloat and move swiftly across water. Not to mention in captivity, they can live up to seven years, but out in the wild, it's a bit riskier with all those predators around. When it comes to grub, they're not too picky. They'll chow down on insects, small critters, fruits, and leaves. Of course, what's on the menu depends on what's available in their neck of the woods. And speaking of woods, basilisk lizards aren't just rainforest dwellers. You can spot them in tropical dry forests and lowland areas near rivers or streams. But there's more to the Amazon than just quirky creatures. Number 10. Grape Tree The Brazilian grape tree, as the name implies, grows primarily in Brazil, although it also thrives in Argentina, Chile, and Peru. The tree is a slow-growing evergreen with fruit that is available all year. The berries are safe to consume raw, and many people use them to make jam. Its fruit, which looks like a grape, is dark purple with thick skin and a gelatinous white flesh inside. Jabuticaba berries have been described as having a grape and lychee flavor with a slightly acidic tang. The manner the Jabuticaba tree yields fruit is one of its most striking characteristics. Unlike most fruit trees which bear fruit on their limbs, the berries of the Jabuticaba tree grow directly on its trunk. Because of this distinguishing trait, the Jabuticaba tree has been dubbed a grape tree by some. The fruits start off green and only become this deep color when mature. The flowers themselves appear twice a year on the tree. Even weirder than the fruits is the ghostly white fuzz. The fruit contains several powerful antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, and anti-cancer chemicals, including one that is unique to the fruit, jaboticaba. But why did this tree evolve in such an unusual manner? The solution is probably straightforward. To make it easier for animals that can't climb to consume its fruit, the tree wants the animals to eat its fruit. But it's not just the trees that have found a unique method of adapting to the wilderness of the Amazon. Number 9. Green Anaconda Now, you can debate that this was the anaconda that inspired Nick Minaj's classic hit, but it's more sinister than we care to remember. 
The green anaconda is one of the largest snakes globally, with females being notably larger than males. They can grow over 30 feet in length, 12 inches in diameter, and weigh more than 550 pounds. These non-venomous snakes have a dark olive-brown color with distinct black and yellow spots. They use their teeth and powerful jaws to catch prey, then coil their muscular bodies around them to suffocate or drag them underwater. Green anacondas are primarily found in northern South America, favoring slow-moving rivers, flooded forests, and swamps. They spend most of their time submerged, patiently waiting for prey. Their diet includes large rodents, deer, fish, and various other animals. They can swallow their prey whole, regardless of size, after asphyxiating them. These snakes face threats mainly from human fear, as some are killed out of concern for potential attacks. They are also hunted for their skin, used for leather and decoration. Except another disturbing mystery has scientists scratching their heads. Number 8. Parasitic Wasps Enter the Zatipoda Wasp, a master manipulator that turns the tables on orb-weaving spiders in a chilling, parasitic twist. Picture this, a seemingly innocent wasp, but with a sinister agenda. It locates its unsuspecting spider victim, and with surgical precision, lays its eggs on the unsuspecting arachnid. The unsuspecting spider, now host to an impending doom, goes about its web-spinning business, oblivious to the sinister fate awaiting it. But here's where it gets truly shocking. The wasp larvae, hatched from their unholy eggs, take control of their unwitting eight-legged host. They release a chemical cocktail that hijacks the spider's very instincts, compelling it to weave a peculiar cocoon, a cocoon meant not for itself, but to safeguard the parasitic wasp's precious offspring. It's a twisted nursery rhyme, written in the language of nature's most sinister schemes. As the spider labors away, weaving a cocoon that harbors its ultimate undoing, you can't help but marvel at the Zatipoda's nefarious brilliance. It's nature's own horror story, a tale of manipulation and parasitic triumph that leaves you equal parts fascinated and horrified. It's no surprise that this deathly sneak attack has caught the attention of scientists everywhere, except there is one more small creature that is giving the scientific community goosebumps. Number 7. Fanged Frog Discovery In Sulawesi, Indonesia, scientists have made a remarkable discovery, a new type of frog with fangs. Known as Limnonectes larvipartis, what sets this frog apart from others is its extraordinary ability to give birth to tadpoles. But that's not all. This special frog also fertilizes its eggs inside its body, a rare reproductive strategy in the amphibian world. These fanged frogs are unique to Sulawesi, specifically found in the island's northern peninsula and the western part of the central core. They belong to the Limnonectes family, named after the twin projections on their lower jaws that they use in combat. The males measure about 3.7 centimeters, while females are slightly larger at 4 centimeters. Their backs sport shades of brownish gray, reddish brown, or golden tan, while the undersides may appear yellowish or cream. One of the scientists, Jim McGuire from the University of California at Berkeley, has been immersed in the study of Sulawesi's frogs since 1998. He vividly recalls the moment of astonishment in 2001 when he witnessed tadpoles emerging from a female frog at Bogani Nani Wartabone National Park on the Northern Peninsula. This intriguing event fueled his fascination with these creatures. But there is one other frog species competing with fanged frogs in terms of uniqueness. Number 6. Tungara Frogs Amongst the symphony of Amazonian sounds, a remarkable chorus arose from the Tungara frogs. Tungara frogs communicate in a totally unique way. These frogs, unlike humans, have a repertory that incorporates both sound and visual signals to convey themselves. It's as if they're putting on a small audio-visual performance to communicate their goals. Consider this scenario. A male Tungara frog serenades a female with a sweet call while flashing light patterns on his throat. It's like a froggy concert with its own stunning light show. This combination of music and light produces a sensory symphony that is essential for wooing and mating. Researchers investigate the visual system of female Tungara frogs to better comprehend this intriguing communication strategy. They want to figure out how these amphibians perceive and interpret these dual messages, which is similar to cracking a secret code but in frog language. 
It's like discovering the biological alchemy that enables them to perceive these multi-sensory messages. Finally, researchers are looking into how their brains perceive both the auditory and visual components of the male's voice. It's truly an evolutionary discovery of the century. But this isn't the only discovery that's mystified scientists. Now it's time for today's subscriber pick. Before we go on, like this video and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face while you're sleeping. It's time for today's subscriber pick. One of our subscribers shared an image with us that has left her and her friends wondering and puzzled. You see, Amazon's secrets are aplenty, and while digging for shocking discoveries, she discovered this image. It appears to be a preserved corpse, or maybe a recently deceased member of a tribal community. Except, how old is it? Can it be dated back to ancient times? So what do you think? The answers await. Remember to comment down below with the hashtag and let us know what you think. Now, on to the next topic. Number 5. Insects with Transparent Wings In the lovely sunlight of the Amazonian canopy, a revelation unfolds. The glass wing butterflies. Their wings, once thought to be fragile and translucent, prove to be nature's own marvel. The blushing phantom butterfly, scientifically known as Citherius pireta, is native to the lush rainforests of Central and South America. It belongs to a unique group of butterflies called clear-winged butterflies. Unlike most butterflies whose wings have small scales giving them vibrant colors, clear-winged butterflies like Citherius pireta have wings that seem almost see-through because they lack these scales. These butterflies, including the Pseudohatteria hypesia, which is related to the blushing phantom, prefer the heart of the rainforest, hidden deep within the vegetation. They tend to be most active during the twilight hours. This makes them a fascinating and stunning sight for those fortunate enough to catch a glimpse. The best part is that their wings allow them to disappear among the lush green forest and escape capture from predators. Except, there are more eye-popping creatures in this forest. Number 4. Glowworms In a big surprise, scientists found a brand new kind of glowworm in the Amazon rainforest. This was a real game-changer because unlike other glowworms we knew about in Australia and New Zealand, these ones were living in the dirt. It all started when a nature photographer named Jeff Creamer took pictures of these strange worms during a night hike in Tambapata, Peru. He couldn't figure out what they were, so he shared the pictures online. No one had seen anything like it before. Later, Jeff teamed up with bug expert Aaron Pomerantz and some students to learn more. What they discovered was mind-blowing. These glowworms were hunters. They buried themselves in the ground, leaving only their heads sticking out, ready to grab any passing bugs with their huge jaws. What's even cooler is that these worms could turn their glow on and off. They'd shine brighter when they felt threatened and stay dark when they were disturbed but not scared. Pomerantz thinks these worms use a special light-making substance called luciferin, just like fireflies. They might belong to a family of bugs known as click beetles, but there's a chance they're a completely new species that no one has seen before. This discovery has shaken up what we thought we knew about glowworms. It's a reminder that we will truly always discover new things about our planet, much like this next species. Number 3. Wood-Eating Catfish the newly discovered wood-eating catfish, belonging to the genus Panak, has revealed a host of remarkable traits that set it apart in the world of aquatic life. The Panak catfish has an unusual feeding fondness for wood, which is unique among the roughly 700 species of armored catfish. Panak species are said to have developed peculiar spoon-shaped teeth, a unique adaptation for digesting submerged wood to accommodate their wood-eating behavior. Panak catfish thrive in Central and South America's freshwater habitats, including the Magdalena, Orinoco, and Amazon River basins. This species is culturally significant to the Sharanawa people and is a popular ingredient in their cuisine. It is known locally as Ishgun Mahuan, which means large armored catfish. On the other hand, catching Panak catfish is difficult, often requiring the use of gill nets, cast nets, or even shooting, as they do not readily accept baited lines. The Panak catfish lives in remote, pristine areas of the Amazon River, such as Peru's Fitzgerald Arch. However, prospective infrastructural developments, lumber extraction, and agricultural operations pose immediate risks to these environments. 
Unlike most wood-digesting animals, which have longer gut transit times, Panak catfish metabolize wood in less than four hours. This implies a unique feeding technique. The discovery of this peculiar wood-eating catfish species highlights the expanse of South America's unexplored freshwater species. Except it's not the only unusual discovery weirding people out. Number 2. Carnivorous Plant Among the vibrant foliage of the Amazon, a smelly plant emerges. The corpse flower, or Amorphophallus titanum, is a plant with the world's largest unbranched inflorescence. It can grow up to 10 feet tall and has a horrible odor comparable to a decaying body. It usually takes around seven years to bloom for the first time. But when it does, it only stays open for about two days. And it's not just one flower, but a bunch of small ones that you can see when the plant blooms. This flower is the largest of its kind in the world and can grow taller than nine feet. While it's blooming, the corpse flower warms up to 98 degrees. This helps spread its strong smell even further, drawing in pollinators. This unique flower comes from Sumatra, Indonesia, and is mainly pollinated by flies and carrion beetles. When it's not in bloom, the corpse flower grows a single leaf that can stretch up to 15 feet tall, looking a bit like a small tree. Interestingly, people flocked to see it earlier in July 2023 at the Amazon Spheres in Seattle. For Ben Iben, the Spheres program manager and the horticulture team, the corpse flower is more than just a plant. It's a mascot for sparking interest in the world of botany. Despite its powerful stench, this botanical marvel is capturing the hearts and noses of plant enthusiasts and curious onlookers alike. But it's not the only mystery wreaking havoc. Number 1. Alien Discovery Lastly, the indigenous Iquitu peoples of Alto Nane, northeast of Lima, Peru, have just been visited by their own mystery. Our best guess is that perhaps alien intruders have stirred things. Peruvian police are investigating claims of eight-foot armored creatures terrorizing villagers in the Peruvian Amazon jungle. There have been numerous sightings of odd beings in the area since at least July 11, 2023. Witnesses have reported yellowed eyes and spherical shoes or feet with a bright red light, allowing the creatures to float roughly a meter above the ground. Others have compared them to pelicaras, a creature from local folklore that is claimed to eat the fat and organs of its victims. They are also said to be immune to human weapons and to vanish as swiftly as they appear as if they are protected by an extraterrestrial cloaking system. Whatever they are, they have been terrorizing the community for over a month, resulting in an attack in which a 15-year-old was badly injured. Either way, the locals have taken it upon themselves to hunt down the creature. This all has happened right after a surge in reports of unidentified aerial phenomena activity and a former intelligence community member spilling the beans to Congress about a supposed UFO sighting. Now, it's hard to say if this influx of alien buzz is rooted in reality or just a byproduct of some shared excitement. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.